Hello family, I went to dinner at Il Viago, the Italian restaurant aboard Carnival Venezia. It is the replacement of Cucina del Capitano that you would find on other carnival ships. So let me tell you about my experience. Was it worth it? Was it good? You know, I'm here to tell you the good, the bad, the indifferent. I rate food on a scale of one to five. And so here it is. It starts off with assortment of bread. They'll ask you which bread that you would like to eat. After that, you get a choice of appetizer, super salad, entree, and dessert. So what did I have in each category? And so I would like to show you the menu overall. So this is what the menu looks like. And from this menu, I had for appetizer the frito misto. And so the frito misto is lightly battered deep fried shrimp with vegetables, calamari, and garlic aioli. So when I tell you this thing, it was a little heavy um, to be the first thing I really had after the bread, but it was delicious. Everything was flavorful, it was seasoned, and so therefore I had to give it a five out of five. I just, it, even though it was light, it was lightly breaded, it wasn't overwhelming, but I guess it, everything was fried. So there was nothing really to, to cut some of that richness of the fried food. And so, but I had to give it a five out of five. It was delicious. It was so much better, I think, than maybe just having fried calamari by itself. And so five out of five for that. Then I had the Caesar salad. Um, as I said, Caesar salad, unless they do something extraordinarily or very different than any other. Um, I really don't rate Caesar salad. I just wanted something lighter after having all the fried food in the appetizer. Then I went to my entree. Initially, I wanted the chicken, chicken dish, but then I decided I wanted something lighter. And so I went with the sea bass. And so the thing about the sea bass, or the thing about fish in general, sometimes I don't like to order fish because I feel like sometimes they under season it. Um, and it's just, was, it's not good. And I just feel like it would need to be more flavorful. So let me tell you about the sea bass. The sea bass had Parmesan crust, bean stew, sauce verde, and broccoli. So let me premise this by saying that the waitress said it was so delicious. And she said that she's not on a person that normally likes fish. And so I was like, okay, let me try it. It was so delicious. It was so great. Oh my gosh, it was five out of five all the way. It Everything about that dish, the sauce, even without the sauce, you know, sometimes you have parts of the fish that I didn't have the sauce on. It was just so great. I, I finished that whole dish. It was just that great. Five out of five all the way. I would recommend it if you are going to this restaurant and you don't feel for something heavier, like the pork dish or chicken or whatever that you get this fish. Hopefully that it maintains its level of consistency by the time that you try it, five out of five. And then for dessert, I had the mile high gelato pie. And so each layer had different flavors in it. And so I loved it. Um, I thought that it was great. Um, and I had to give it a five out of five. It was delicious. It was, I feel like it could be something for more than one person though. So if you're with somebody and maybe they have something more like a cake and instead of having ice cream, you could kind of cut that in half. I was by myself. And so by the time I had appetizer, the entree, the salad, um, it was a little bit much. And then on top of that, they gave you complimentary a shot of limoncello and then what they consider to be i'm not sure what sh the waitress gave me the name but it seemed like lightly fried pastry with powdered sugar on it very thin and it was it was delicious for what it was it was just and so i thought that in general the meal was just a great meal 
it was such a great experience the service was good it was more than one waitress that was serving me one waitress took my order and things of that nature then another waitress also was seeing to me but then the other one so you know it is not like it was all on one person it was almost like they were working together as you would find also in the dining room usually in the dining room you would find that there's more than one waiter that is seeing to you and making sure that you are having a great experience i loved this restaurant i enjoyed it um, i would recommend it if you're going on carnival venezia if you're coming on this ship i would recommend it for you to go and try it out for yourself let me know what you think i'm gonna put something in the comments if it's something different that you tried that i didn't try then let me know what you thought about what you tried so that maybe if i come back on this ship that i'll try that dish and see if i like it as much as you liked it and so um let me know in the comments in the meantime family can you do me a favor can you like comment and subscribe click on the notification bell to be informed of future posts and until next time, happy travels.